Hello again, and welcome to Photo Stories. We're, we look to make images and not just take them. This time we're going to discuss portraits. Is it possible to make a portrait? Yes. Where well, you're not just taking it. Where you have a concept in mind, or something you thought about, something you saw on the internet, whatever the case may be. This particular image, if you remember, there was a very famous uh, picture taken in the 40s, early 40s, after World War II of the Navy sailor man uh, dipping the girl. I'm, I'm sure you've seen it at some point in time. Believe it or not, that picture was taken in Detroit and on Woodward, the same spot that this one was taken. And this was the concept. This was an engagement shoot that I did for this couple. And I was like, hey, you guys want to recreate a cool image? And this is what's good about having a, a creative and fun couple or, or person to work with is because they're open to concepts and ideas. And, and as soon as I told them that, they were, they were all in. So in between the stoplights, we ran out into the middle of Woodward and looked to recreate this shot. If you see the way, I mean, he, she is dipped absolutely perfectly where she lines up right with, you know, the cars and, and, and the signage and everything. It's just, it's just a wonderful, wonderful image. And they're, they're going to treasure this for, for a very long time. This is actually one of my favorite uh, portrait images. So, remember, make make something make a memory make it make it better than what it could be instead of just a couple of people you know giving a thumbs up hey we got engaged give them something a little bit more so that brings us now to photo number two look at this love this picture this is a fabulous picture. This is still my girlfriend. And what we did here is I like it when you can get a little moody with the portrait. You can get a little creative with the light. And, and, and what we sought out to do was take a flashlight portrait. The concept was to do anything but just a standard portrait. And that's what this is. So we took a flashlight. It took six seconds to go from top to bottom. And a little tip, you only want to do that flashlight just one time. So whether in your home studio or someplace in your room, make sure it's really dark when you do this. Six seconds. Your ISO for this particular one was 500 because they wanted to make sure we had enough light coming in. At, I believe it was, F5 or F6 to do this. The camera is a light sensor. So it's going to pick up wherever that light is. And you create something a little bit moody, a little bit romantic, a little bit, you know, mysterious, if you will. So don't just take a standard portrait. Take a creative one. This is something they will treasure. This was in an art gallery. Um, as well as some of my other ones and got quite a quite a few people come up and ask me how did I take that shot and I hope I inspire them to go out and do it themselves and if you want a picture like this or like the other one feel free to contact me if you live in the southeast Michigan area and we can set up a portrait shoot and do something really creative and really fun See you in the next one.